Stay tuned because Good Sports is coming up next. Kansas City Sports and Fitness is the magazine for sports fans in KC. Inside, we cover local sports and local teams from pro to peewee and everything in between. And this month's free copy of Kansas City Sports and Fitness includes the KC Baseball Report presented by Budweiser. You'll find Kansas City Sports and Fitness all over KC at places like the Overland Park Golf Club. And it's free, so pick one up today. This show was recorded live on Saturday, May 19th. Five. Four, three, two, one, zero. Welcome to Good Sports, the Kansas City Sports and Fitness and She KC Show. This segment is presented by Kansas City Chiropractic. Kansas City Chiropractic understands the high pressure demands placed upon individuals in the workplace and the athletic demands people place on their bodies. They offer the care that can relieve pain and stress and improve overall health. You can call them at 816-753-4600 or visit KansasCityChiropractic.com. Hello, everyone. I am Steve Fish. I'm the publisher of Kansas City Sports and Fitness and SheKC Magazines, and you are watching or listening to Good Sports, the Kansas City Sports and Fitness and SheKC show. Now, this show is being taped at former Royal Danny Jackson's Incredible, located at 151st in Antioch. Bowling, mini golf, and laser tag with your coupon from KC Sports. You can buy a double play of any two of those activities and get a second double play free. Uh, check out Incredible also if you're planning a party or a corporate event. Visit Incredible.com or call 913-851-1700. Now today we're taping our radio show which will be playing on ESPN 1510 at 8 a.m. and our TV show, which can be seen on SureWest Cable Channel 7 at 8.30 a.m., at 4.30 p.m., and at 8.30 p.m. every single day. And now you can also view our shows and some of our past shows on YouTube. And all you do is search for the Good Sports KC channel. It's all one word, Good Sports KC. Now, before we get started with the show, I want to tell everyone that the current issue of Kansas City Sports and Fitness is available free at over 700 locations in KC. And this month, with our May issue, the KC, KC Sports continues to celebrate our 15th year as the magazine for sports fans in KC. And our new issue of She KC is now available at over 500 locations. Now, in our current issue of KC Sports, we feature our KC Baseball Spotlight, presented by Budweiser. Now, this month, we take a look at how the Royals made history with their early season losing streak uh, that they went through. Plus, we question whether it is really our time for the Royals. And in GKC, we have a story on a female boxer from here in Kansas City who is getting ready for a title bout. Plus, we share information on the importance of stretching. Now, you can pick up your copy of our current issue of KC Sports at Burger King's at both Minsky's on Berry Road, Mr. Good Sense, the Kansas City Ice Center, and at Dick's Sporting Goods in the KC metro area. And for a complete list of locations where you can find KC Sports Magazine, visit our website, kcsportspaper.com. You'll find a link to a list of locations right on the front page of the website, and you can actually check out a PDF of the entire issue on the website as well. And our publication, SheKC, is now out and available at many of the locations where you'll find KC Sports. Plus, you can visit our website, SheKC.com. You can check us out on Facebook by searching SheKC, all one word, and follow us on Twitter at She underscore KC. Now, as I mentioned, we are out at Danny Jackson's Incredible, which is located at 151st and Antioch. And today, we're going to talk with Danny a little bit later on in the show. We've got a full slate of... 85 Royals World Champs, and we're starting off with our friend, a friend to our show, Greg Pryor, uh, obviously uh, wearing that World Series ring that he wears to all of our shows. He gets dressed up and wears it to all of our shows. He, Greg is a regular co uh, contributor to KC Sports. He provides information on nutritional supplements that can help each of us, um, and uh, we're going to talk a little baseball first off with that. You were, you were saying to me right before we came on the air that uh, there was a story that you had on how not to motivate players. <laughs> you know, the Royals, all obviously, on a 162-game schedule. You know, every team is going to need some different motivation, both internal. They have to motivate yourself internally, but the manager sometimes takes things into his own hand. What what was the story? Well, in the minor leagues, I uh, played uh, six years, and uh, we had a team meeting uh, after a losing streak, and the manager was sitting there with the fungal bat, which is a bat that uh, is used to hit ground balls uh, to, uh, you know, the infielders and the outfielders. Right. And 
he had a metal trash can next to him, and uh, it looked like the trash can had been beat up a few times. <laughs> so about halfway through his motivational speech, he started beating, beating the trash can with the fungo bat. In fact, it splintered, and uh, I was trying to hold back from laughing. <laughs> <laughs> he was hitting the trash can better than we were. <laughs> but, uh, no, it's, uh, it's, it's a tough job being the manager of anything, and especially uh, baseball players, because you can't, uh, after the fact, you can't tell them what they should have done, and you hope that they can do it when they're supposed to. And, uh, you know, we're, our team is uh, getting closer to first place after the tough start we had. But, yeah. And yeah. There's, there's hope, and, uh, you know, having Duffy go down certainly didn't help. But, uh, you know, maybe somebody else can step in and, uh, and, and take up, pick up the slack. So do the Royals get a discount on Tommy John surgeries? Because I think there's actually three of them that they're going through right nope. now. There's, there's what, Duffy and, and Soria. And then I think there was somebody else that was listed as well that was having Tommy John uh, as well. Uh, I, don't, I don't remember who. You know who. who should get money on that is Tommy John. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Gee, don't you wish you had a, an injury that Imagine. the Greg Pryor, I don't <laughs> no, know what. No. <laughs> the slow bat. <laughs> Cure for a slow the bat. The slow bat. Oh, okay. So, so what is the cure for a slow, slow bat? No, just uh, work out uh, over hitting the, hitting to right field. Uh, work, I guess work, work out a lot over the winter. <laughs> really, you know, really. You know, it, it's one thing about uh, the, how the bat. Um, you start out the season using a certain weight of your bat. I I use a thirty two, thirty two and a half. And as the season went on, if, if you're playing a lot, you know, that, that 32 and a half will seem like a 34 and a half. Yeah. So sometimes you have to go down a half an ounce. And a lot of major league players can uh, get a dozen bats in their hand and close their eyes, and they can pick which one's 32 ounce or 32 and a half ounce. That's how, wow. that's how precise wow. uh, veterans are about picking the weights of their bats. See, I used to always use this bat, and it, and it, was, just, it was because I just wanted to get any wood on it as possible. And it was, it was a Jackie Robinson model, which I, it, it was like this thick in the hands, yeah. so that if I was jammed on the inside, at least I got some wood on the bat. But I don't think that was necessarily the best bat to really use because it wasn't a quick one. You, you, couldn't, you couldn't turn it quickly because you had yeah. so much weight. Across the bat. Yeah, I, I what kind of bat did you use? Well, I, I used a pretty thin-handled bat. It's a yeah. P72. That's the model, Louisville Slugger. And uh, the reason I used a thin-handled bat is because the thicker bat, just like you said, it's, it would seem like mentally it was harder for me to get the bat head out in front. And uh, I had to get that bat head out in front as much as possible. And a, and a thin handle helped me. Yeah, and with the skill level that you guys played at, obviously that's this much of the bat is what you wanted to put on the ball anyway. The rest of it didn't matter. And that's why Bo Jackson could probably take it and break one on yeah. over his knees because it was thin in that other spot. And all he really cared about was getting the end of the bat, the, the sweet know, spot. And, on. Steve, another thing that's changed in baseball that, um, you, from the past days, and, and once in a while you'll see it now, but not very often, is, uh, you know, I choked up a little bit on my mm-hmm. bat. I, it was up about an inch, inch and a half. Depends mm-hmm. on, you know, how heavy my bat felt and how, what kind of plate coverage I had. But now I see guys with two strikes. You know, Rod Carew was one of my favorite players of all time, a, a Hall of Famer. Yeah. And Rod would adjust with two strikes. He, he would change his stance, and he would get, uh, you know, he was not going to strike out. He was going to hit the ball hard but with a, an adjusted stance. And now I see guys get up with two strikes, and they take the same stri- uh, swing. <laughs> they hold the bat on the end with two strikes as they did with zero strikes. And that's just how the game's changed. And, uh, you know, I just... Uh, Why? I, I don't, I don't yeah, know. I, I mean, you know, the, the, other, the other thing is, you know, we always learned when, when we were playing ball. Now, granted, we're, we're not at the, uh, at the level that you, you played at, but you always catch the ball with two hands. You know, you put, you put your one hand up, you got your glove, and then you always closed it because probably because a lot of times when you were a kid, it fell out of the glove. You weren't, really didn't have control of the glove. But you don't see the pros doing that. They're, they're you know, in our case, it would have been, been called hot dog in it. And, and, you know, it's well, not necessarily that way. Was there a, is there a reason for that? Uh, well, here's what here's my philosophy on fielding uh, anywhere. If a kid can uh, catch it, uh, I don't care if his hand's behind <laughs> his back. If he can get the ball in his glove <laughs> and he can get it out of his glove quickly, right. I don't care where the other hand is. Uh, sometimes it's better to, if it's the ball's at you to have it near in case you bobble it. Right. But uh, as I said, if you can make the play uh, with a hand tied behind your back, uh, you know, let him keep on doing it. Don't don't try to correct them because uh, instinct is what uh, helps players become better. You know, they have instincts and. I was a corner, sort of a one-handed fielder, but I could get the ball from my glove into my hand very quickly, right. so it didn't matter to me. But it's coming at you so fast, especially at third base, that you kind of have to be a one-handed fielder for the most part, unless you're charging in on it. And then if you're charging in on it and it's a low grounder, anyway, both hands are going to be down low because you've got to be down low anyway. So Yeah, well, at third base, it's a little bit different because uh, once the ball's in your glove, you have another half second to get it in your hand to throw it at shortstop. Right. You know, I, I put my hand closer to my glove when I played major league short, 
because I, I had to get it out of there quicker. So it, it just depends on how much time you have, and that how much time you have is in, in instinct and knowing how fast the runner's going down the line. Right. Now, um, I read a story that actually before you made the majors, you had an injury that a doctor and a doctor told you to quit baseball. Is that? Well, I dislocated my shoulder when I was 19. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. And um, doctor, three weeks later, the doctor told me that I'd never lift my left arm the rest of my life because I had torn the nerves, wow. which control muscles in yeah. my left shoulder, and I couldn't lift my left arm, and it was completely numb. And uh, he told me, he says, son, you've lost the use of your left arm. You'll have to put it in a sling or put it in your waist the rest of your life. And then, oh he, my. then he walked out of the room. <laughs> but, and uh, that's where you wanted to start laughing, too. Well, no, was, not at 19, though. I was more <laughs> upset because I, I loved golf back then, and I couldn't uh-huh. imagine playing golf one-handed. Uh, it, was, it was one of those more traumatic uh, uh, things uh, that happened to me in my life. But obviously, it didn't. Uh, he wasn't right. right. Uh, I did lose some muscles in my shoulder. But I found uh, that you can uh, get the other muscles to compensate for the ones that you lost by training them and making them stronger. Right. Because right. there, there's people that paint with their mouth. They paint with their feet. Uh, so mm-hmm. I, 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 when I talk to kids, I tell them, that, hey, you can do anything in life. You know, right. You, you, right. We're all going to have tough times, but how are you going to overcome it? So uh, as I said, I, I overcame it, and I became a real good major league infielder. And, uh, but I like telling that story because, um, you know, of something that I overcame. Absolutely, yeah. And at 19, of course, you're healing a little bit faster and things like that. But, but most definitely, that you know that it it didn't throw your career off, other than for that little bit of time. That oh it, yeah, that it, it, it took to heal. Sl- it slowed me down. But uh, and, and is that I, what is that the slow bat that you're talking no. about there? <laughs> well, you know, because you're going to lead with that shoulder. Well, right? actually, what happened uh, in my hitting area, uh, Steve, is I had to become more of a right-handed hitter than a left-handed hitter. Mm-hmm. Uh, a lot of guys that you'll see take the top hand off if they're right-handed. They'll take the right hand off the top little bit quicker right uh but me i i kept my top hand on the bat and i hit more with my top hand because of my weaker left shoulder my weaker left side and i'm sure it it affected my power because i I wasn't known as a power hitter but had i not dislocated my shoulder i think i would have had more home runs uh, in my career but you know i compensated for it and i i I liked it with my top hand because uh, one of my old hitting instructors was rocky calavito Really? And uh, oh, Rocky wow. was a top-hand type of a hitting coach, and he really liked it. Well, he hit a bunch of home runs, though, didn't yeah. he? Wasn't he a big home run yeah, hitter? Yeah, yeah, for Cleveland Indians. He yeah. was, he was yeah. one of my heroes when I was wow. growing, growing up. And I loved it uh, that he liked teaching top-hand hitting. And it's just uh, what you, how, how are you going to get the bad head on the ball? Whether it's bottom hand, top hand, both hands. Is there more gu- <coughs> more guidance of the bat if, if you're – Hitting with the well, the top hand, I guess, I guess is which it's the top hand on the bat. If, uh, if the, this is the base of the bat, it's this hand up here. So, is there more guidance well, of it because you're using your right it, hand to guide the bat, and you're right-handed, or or, or does it? Yeah, they you know. say that the left hand to guide hand, and the top hand is your power hand. Oh, uh, okay. But, but the problem I have with young hitters is that they, they start loosening the top hand a little bit too soon mm-hmm. during the swing. I, I want them to to hold on to the bat through when uh, bef- uh, is. Uh, when the bat's off the ball, it's okay to start taking it off. Right. But a lot of them start loosening their grip on their top hand before they hit the ball. They start throwing, yeah. and, and it almost looks like they're throwing the bat. Yeah. At and the ball. you know, one of the best hitters you know I ever seen. I played with for five years. You know, George. Yeah. He looked like he took the top hand off, but but he didn't. And, yeah. And, and he yeah. he has caused some kids to you know swing one handed, trying to emulate him, which I don't mind anybody emulating a hall of fame hitter like him but <laughs> but uh, i tell kids i said keep that top hand on all the way around well, there we go kids you've got your batting lesson for the day most definitely now now as i mentioned greg is also a, c- a contributor to kc sports uh now in our may issue you tied in a story with mother's day um to discuss a topic that affects our female population but also guys you know uh it's it's a an ep- not an epidemic, but an, an issue that affects men as well, and that is heart disease. Um, you posted, listed a bunch of alarming statistics, and I w- want to start off with some of those. You want to share some of those from the article? I'll, I'll jump into because I've got it on my notes. Well, you know, there's a lot of the things that, um, that causes trouble is and health-wise as we age, nope. and uh, the heart obviously is probably the the one that uh, is working constantly in our bodies and. That's one that a lot of people have trouble with. Uh, and I, what I wanted to do uh, in this issue was talk about omega-3 right? and how important it was uh, to uh, get omega-3s in the diet. And it's not that if it, that I'm in the supplement business, obviously. Right, right. And, and people say, well, you know, do I need to eat if I take your stuff? We're not trying to replace food. <laughs> what we're trying to do is talk to people that aren't getting the essentials right. in their food. Right. And omega-3s are essential. 
and I, 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 I get, make it very simple for people. I say, if you're not getting it in your food, where are you going to get it from? Mm-hmm. Well, I eat fish once a week. Well, that's probably not enough. Right. So omega-3s are found in deep sea fish, and, um, but a lot of people don't want to take uh, omega-3s, Steve, because they, uh, they think they're going to uh, burp up a fishy taste. Right. Or they can't take, uh, they can't take uh, big pills, they say. Well, there's two ways around it. I, I found an omega-3 that doesn't taste like fish after you take it. It's, right. de- it's deodorized. And number right. two, I, I even take omega-3 and I put it in my dog's food. I, I take it right. out of the capsule. Right. So there's different ways you can take it. So we, we wrote about omega-3 in the article this, uh, this month, and we're really happy uh, to let people know that uh, then and we listed reasons why they should take it. Yeah, and, and some of those reasons is they can help with, obviously, with your heart. It helps your uh-huh. heart. It helps your brain. Uh, cholesterol and triglycerides. I mean, it, it's it's amazing the number of things. Joints and arthritis. Yeah, you and, know. and the FDA finally let a, a minor claim be made on uh, the use of omega threes in health. And uh, you know, I, I, you mentioned the brain. It's very important for the brain, especially for any mo- young mothers that are listening to this show mm-hmm. uh, or or going to have a baby. Uh, the babies need to have a, a DHA in their breast milk or in their in their formula. And uh, you'll see a lot of the major uh, manufacturers of infant, infant formula now adding omega-3s to the formula. So mothers uh, need to really research that as they think about bringing children into the world, that uh, the, the growth of a baby's brain is so important to, mm-hmm. to, to make sure it has omega-3s in its, in, in its diet early on. Mm-hmm. It, it can help also with skin and beauty. That's important to us. <laughs> <laughs> uh, immune system, and of course, you know, uh, there's a connection as well with lowering the risk of breast and prostate cancer is something that I, that I read as well. You know, well. it's funny. I was watching a show on TV the other day. I think her name was Beverly Johnson. She was a, a very famous uh, uh, model, actress, mm-hmm. lady. And uh, they were showing uh, some, it was on the doctor show on TV. Yeah, yeah. And uh, she was cutting o- open an omega-3 capsule and rubbing it on her face uh, before she uh, would uh, put her makeup on. Really? I, I've never heard about that. I wonder what it does. I don't know. Wow. Just, it, I don't know. She thought it would help I her. guess we're going to have to try that before we put our makeup on well, when we come on TV, huh? Couldn't hurt. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Thanks. But, uh, Thanks, Greg. <laughs> but the thing about, a little one more thing about the product I offer, uh, you know, you can get omega-3s or fish oil. That's basically yeah. where it comes from. Uh, you don't get them at the store, but uh, I, I didn't want to get uh, the cheapest kind of omega-3 I could get. So I got a highly uh, concentrated version in my company, and people get 60% uh, of omega-3s in the capsule versus what normal store uh, omega-3s are 30%. Really? Mm-hmm. And what's the usual dosage with the, it's, it's called omega-3 pri- priority. Yeah. Well, you can take uh, two capsules a day. It'll, okay. it'll give you uh, okay. 2,000 two um, uh, uh, milligrams. In, in one, at uh, one uh, feeding or one in the I, morning? I would one split it up. You, really? you know, most yeah. people take their supplements once a day. I try, I try to teach people to take them every time they eat right. because the, you never know when your body's going to need them. So you take two of mine. But a lot of times, a lot of the s- clinical studies have been used, uh, done with using four to five grams of omega-3 a day. So it's really up to the person what they're, what's in their diet and what's mm-hmm. not. Mm-hmm. And, and, and any, any physical things that they might be addressing to try to see if it might help them. Right. Yeah. Some of the other things, vision, it helps with, yeah. with that as well. Uh, digestive system. I mean, you know, it, it's like why wouldn't you take something like this? It's, you know, allergies, which we're all suffering from right now, and, and diabetes as well. It's connected with, with helping with that, too. Yeah, it's you, like, you know, wow. I, I can't make medical claims. Yeah, on, I know you can't. Omega I know. 3, and, and we're not, uh, if the FDA is listening. Uh, <laughs> But uh, it's one of those essentials I like talking about yeah. because, you know, it's, it's in the body in some form. So if you're not getting it in your food, get logical, you know, use it after meals. And, and even if you are getting it in your food, you should still probably supplement unless you're on some particular yeah. special diet of some kind. But, um, you know, I, I, you mentioned that there's a long chain and a short chain. Uh, omega-3. Uh, what is the long chain? What does that come Well, you from? know, I, I brought this in case you were going to ask me to pronounce uh, the DHA and the EPA. Uh, the sure, go ahead. The, 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 I'll, I'll <laughs> no, try no, that's okay. The, the, the EPA <laughs> is uh, icosapentaenoic acid, and the DHA is DOCA, so hexanaic acid. So there we go. And, and you know, the short chain, uh, 
That's a low a long chain. The short chain uh, is alpha lipoic acid. And a lot of people uh, listening might think they're getting omega th- enough omega 3s, the EPA and DHA, from flaxseed oil right. or flaxseed. Right. But the, uh, uh, the uh, omega 3s in those are alpha linoleic acid or ALA, which has to be converted to EPA. And it's just my feeling, and uh, it's based on science, not my, uh, anything more than science, that y- you'd have to eat a lot of flaxseed ground up to, right. get, to get the adequate amounts of EPA and DHA. So getting uh, omega-3s, EPA and DHA from flaxseed or flaxseed oil is not very practical. Right, and I, I read that the long chain is found in fish, and that's a little, you get more out of that. Mm-hmm. You, you get more out of that. Now, we've got a special offer for our Kansas City Sports and Fitness and our Good Sports uh, viewers and listeners that you can get free shipping for any of the Life Priority products that we show here on the screen. Um, if you um, put in the code LIFEP when you go to their website, and the website is? Uh, LifePriority.com. LifePriority.com. Yeah. L-I-F-E-P-R-I-O-R-I-T-Y.com. And, um, and they can email me, uh, customer service, if they mm-hmm. have any questions about anything. And we have been in business uh, since uh, 1994. And uh, very into it. We use what we sell. And uh, we have uh, 18 different products for people. So it's not just the omega-3 we're talking about today. I'm talking about everything that I Absolutely, sell. Yeah. And uh, we're like, uh, we'd like to have people look at our products uh, and see if we can help them uh, spend their money more wisely. Excellent. Well, Greg is going to hang on with us. And he's going to join in our conversation with Danny Jackson if Danny allows him to <laughs> ask a Talk. question or anything like that. Or he allows me to ask a question. I'm just joking, Danny. Um, we're here at, we're going to take a break right now. But we are, uh, you're watching Good Sports, the KC Sports and Fitness and GKC show. We're coming to you from Danny Jackson's Incredible, located at 151st and Antioch. I'm Steve Fish. We will be right back. Join Kansas City Sports and Fitness Magazine, Life Priority, and Sportsaholic at the Incredible Ball Star Game Watch Party on July 10th at Incredible, located at 151st and Antioch. Watch the game with former MLB players. Enjoy a great buffet plus unlimited bowling, mini golf, and laser tag. We'll have Sportsaholic t-shirts, giveaways, and more. This event benefits the KC Baseball Historical Society. Tickets are just $75 and available at Incredible or by calling 913-851-1700. There's more info in the latest KC Sports Magazine. And it's always free, so pick one up today. Are you tired of paying $40, $50, or even $60 to play golf? Great Life Golf and Fitness at River Oaks is changing the game by offering a $29.99 family membership that includes unlimited green fees, a fitness center, and access to Great Life's 16 other locations. And check out all the great weekly specials at River Oaks, including All You Can Play Wednesday, Dollar Beer Fridays, and the Everyday Senior Special. For more information, call River Oaks at 816-966-8111 or visit greatlifegolf.com. These days, we're all so busy, and many of us ignore our health and let stress turn into chronic pain. Dr. Lynn McIntosh of Kansas City Chiropractic understands the pressures we all face and the demands they place on our bodies. Dr. McIntosh can provide you with the proper care to relieve pain and stress, improve your health, and get more out of life. To make an appointment with Dr. McIntosh, call 816-753-4600. Most insurance plans are welcome. For more information on Dr. McIntosh and Kansas City Chiropractic, go online at kansascitychiropractic.com. Sign up now for the 13th annual Run the Good Race 5K to benefit the Sanctuary of Hope on Saturday, June 16th. Visit sanctuaryofhope.org for more details. Run the Good Race is presented by the Barber Financial Group. KC's new golf course is the Heartland Golf Club. Join now for $49.95 per month. And seniors play 18 with cart for just $25 with the coupon in KC Sports and Fitness Magazine. For tee times, call 816-523-8601 or visit heartlandgolfclub.com. Single game tickets for the Kansas City Command are now on sale. Call for tickets at 855-KC-ARENA. Visit kccommand.com or email tickets at KC Command And put yourself right in the middle of the action with your hometown arena football team, the Kansas City Command. Whether you're playing a sport, running a business, or learning how to use an iPad, your ability to make split-second decisions is essential for your success. Hey sports fans, this is Greg Pryor. I was an infielder in Major League Baseball for over nine seasons and was a member of the 85 World Champion Royals. My decisions in the field and at the plate could have been the difference between winning and losing. Since 1994, I have owned a local health supplement company called Life Priority. Life Priority offers many nutritional formulas that give your body the nutrients that can help your brain keep pace in today's fast lifestyle. To see all 17 Life Priority products, please visit my website at lifepriority.com 
or call me at 913-438-5433. Use Life Priority Products and improve your chances of winning. For free shipping, use promo code LIFEP at lifepriority.com or call me today at 913-438-5433. Two of the finest golf clubs in Kansas City are right in Overland Park. St. Andrew's Golf Club at Neiman and 135th Street and Overland Park Golf Club at 125th and Quivera. For tee times, call St. Andrew's at 913-897-3804 and OP Golf Club at 913-897-3809 or visit golfop.com. At Stanley Tire and Auto, you can get an oil change for $22.99, a wheel alignment for $69.99, and seniors can get a 10% discount on their purchase with your coupon from KC Sports and Fitness. Visit Stanley Tire and Auto, located two blocks east of Metcalf off 151st Street, or call 913-239-8473. Find out how you can join thousands who are losing weight the easy way. Take the Body by Vi 90-Day Challenge and join real people who are getting real results. For more information, visit KCMOHealth.com and put yourself on track to a healthier you in just 90 days. are back. You're watching and listening to Good Sports, the Kansas City Sports and Fitness and She KC Show, the show that complements Kansas City Sports and Fitness and She KC Magazines. I am Steve Fish, and today we're coming to you from Danny Jackson's Incredible, located at 151st and Antioch Bowling, Mini Golf, and Laser Tag with your coupon from Kansas City Sports and Fitness. You can buy a double play of any two of those activities and get a second double play free. Check out Incredible if you're planning a party or a corporate event. Visit Incredible.com or call 913-851-1700. Now this segment of Good Sports <clears throat> is brought to you by First Student Charter Bus Rental. Those yellow buses you see that are transporting your kids and some of these kids that are here at Incredible around can also be rented for group activities like taking a group to the big game, corporate events, church or youth group trips, special events, shuttle and more. So the next time you're planning a group outing, choose yellow and choose first. Call 866-514-8747 for details or visit firstcharterbus.com. Now in our current issue of Kansas City Sports and Fitness, check out the Command Report. This month we introduce you to the Command's new quarterback, Matt Gutierrez, who joined the team earlier this month. Plus we want to remind everyone that the Command season is now in progress at the Sprint Center, and their next two home games are Saturday, May 26th, and Saturday, June 2nd. And at GKC, we feature a story on how females are more susceptible to concussions and how soccer and headgear is helping reduce those injuries. Now, you can pick up your copy of Kansas City Sports and Fitness at over 700 locations, including the Kansas City Ice Center and Mafia Mike's Pizza on 87th and Lackman, and Lenexa and Mafia Pizzeria Southside at 127th and Metcalf. Now, you'll find SheKC at over 500 locations, and you can find those locations on our website, SheKC.com. And if you'd like to follow us on Facebook or Twitter, you can go to our websites and follow the links to our pages. Our websites are KCSportsPaper.com and SheKC.com. Now, you can view our shows and this show and our past shows on YouTube as well. All you need to do is search for the Good Sports KC channel when you go to YouTube. Now, we'd like to welcome some new advertisers to Kansas City Sports and Fitness, and they include Stanley Tire and Auto, located two blocks east of Metcalf, off 151st Street, where you can get an oil change for $22.99, a wheel alignment for $69.99, and senior citizens can get a 10% discount on their purchase with your coupon from KC Sports and Fitness. The KC Baseball Historical Society, who are putting on their fifth annual Kansas City Athletics reunion on Friday, June 8th, For more details or tickets, visit Kansas City Baseball Historical Society.com. Of course, where we are doing our show today, Danny Jackson's Incredible, located at 151st and Antioch, uh, where you can uh, bowl, you can play mini golf and laser tag. And of course, we have a coupon in Kansas City Sports and Fitness right now, where if you you buy one double play, which is any two of those activities that I listed, uh, you get a second double play for free, and that's with the coupon. And of course, We're going to talk with Danny in just a few seconds about how you can also plan a party or a corporate event here at Incredible as well. And all you need to do as well as as tune in for us in our next segment with that. But uh, you can check out more information at Incredible.com or also by calling 913-851-1700. And also the 13th annual Run the Good Race on Saturday, June 16th, where you can run a cross-country 5K 
or a 5K road course or both. Uh, Run the Good Race benefits the Sanctuary of Hope, and for more details, visit sanctuaryofhope.org. And St. Andrews Golf Club and Overland Park Golf Club, two of the finest golf clubs in the region. St. Andrews is located at 135th and Neiman, and the Overland Park Golf Club is at 125th and Quivira. Uh, you can visit golfop.com for details on these two great clubs. Plus, we want to mention several advertisers in GKC. They are Family Bicycles, Superior Toyota, Your Wellness Connection, Kansas City Chiropractic, Pulaski and Associates, Sport Court, and Tracy Estes Allstate Office. Now, we're going to take another quick break, and when we come back, Greg Pryor is going to join us again, and we'll talk with Danny Jackson, the owner of Incredible. Uh, you're watching or listening to Good Sports, KC Sports and Fitness, and She KC Show. Uh, coming to you from Danny Jackson's Incredible at 151st and Antioch, I'm Steve Fish. We'll be right back. There's family fun for everyone at Danny Jackson's Incredible. Bowling, mini golf, laser tag, and more. Incredible has it all. And right now with the coupon in KC Sports and Fitness, you can buy one double play and get one free. Are you planning a party? Incredible is a great place for wedding receptions, birthday, graduation, and holiday parties, and corporate events. Visit Incredible at 151st and Antioch. Find them online at Incredible.com or call 913-851-1700. Hyperbaric Oxygen Therapy. It's an unusual name, but it's a simple, safe, effective, and affordable sports injury treatment solution. Hyperbaric Oxygen Therapy has been used by players from the NFL, MLB, PGA, and more to speed recovery from injuries. Now, Hyperbaric Oxygen Therapy is available at Summit of Health, 200 Northeast Chipman in Lee Summit. Go online at summitofhealth.com or call Dr. Susan Anschutz at 816-554-4771 to find out how Hyperbaric Oxygen Therapy can help speed your recovery from injuries. After a million dollar renovation, the Kansas City Ice Center has reopened and is now enrolling for fall classes. Located two miles west of 435 on Johnson Drive, the Kansas City Ice Center is registering students for learn to skate and learn to play hockey classes. Come check out a public skating session at the new Kansas City Ice Center or contact them to schedule a party, room ball game, or group rental. For more information or to register for a class online, visit kcicecenter.com or call 913-441-3033. Sign up now for the Tuesday Par 3 League at the Heart of America Golf Academy or sign up for the Junior Golf Camps this summer. For more information, call the Heart of America Golf Academy at 816-513-8940 or visit hoagolfacademy.com. Get top dollar for your gold at the Gold Rush Exchange. And with your coupon from KC Sports, get 30% off any jewelry purchase. Visit the Gold Rush Exchange at 518 103rd between State Line and Warnell. Call 816-941-RUSH or visit kcgoldrush.com for more details. And get top dollar for your gold at the Gold Rush Exchange. Get two large, two topping pizzas, ten wings, and a two-liter Pepsi for just $21.99 at Mafia Mike's Pizza, 15205 87th in Lenexa, or Mafia Pizzeria Southside at 112627 Metcalf in Overland Park with your coupon from Kansas City Sports. That's two large, two topping pizzas, ten wings, and a two-liter Pepsi for just $21.99 at Mafia Mike's and Mafia Pizzeria Southside. Call Mafia Mike's at 913-660-1441 and Mafia Pizzeria at 913-322-6666. Eagles Landing Golf Course is the place to play golf in the Southland and is by far the best golf value around. Visit EaglesLandingGolfCourse.com and for tee times call 816-318-0004 and make the drive to see why Eagles Landing is the best golf value in KC. Join Kansas City Sports and Fitness Magazine, Life Priority, and Sportsaholic at the Incredible Ball Star Game Watch Party on July 10th at Incredible, located at 151st and Antioch. Watch the game with former MLB players. Enjoy a great buffet plus unlimited bowling, mini golf, and laser tag. We'll have Sportsaholic t-shirts, giveaways, and more. This event benefits the KC Baseball Historical Society. Tickets are just $75 and available at Incredible or by calling 913-851-1700. There's more info in the latest KC Sports Magazine. And it's always free, so pick one up today. Welcome back to Good Sports, Kansas City Sports and Fitness and She KC Show, the show that complements Kansas City Sports and Fitness and She KC Magazines. I am Steve Fish, and today we are coming to you from Danny Jackson's Incredible, located at 151st in Antioch, bowling, mini golf, 
and laser tag with your coupon from Kansas City Sports and Fitness. You can buy a double play of any two of those activities and get a second double play free. Check out Incredible if you're planning a party or a corporate event. And you can visit Incredible.com or call 913-851-1700. Now, this segment of Good Sports is brought to you by the experts who each will be a part of our show during the month. They are Dr. Lynn McIntosh from Kansas City Chiropractic off the plaza. Former Royals World Series champ Greg Pryor from Life Priority Nutrition, who will share nutritional supplement information with us, just like he did in our earlier segment. And Dr. Susan Anschutz from the Summit of Health Chiropractic in Lee Summit. Each will join us on the air once a month to talk about things like exercise, health solutions, sports, and more. And you can read a health or a sports tip from each in our current issue of Kansas City Sports and Fitness. To read each of their current articles, pick up your copy of KC Sports at over 700 locations, including the Burger Kings and Sport Clips in the KC metro area. Now, in this month's She KC, we outline the benefits of massage, plus we tell you about the Revolve Community uh, Bike Shop Earn a Bike program. Now, I also want to mention that on June 2nd, we will be at the Kansas City Ice Center recording an upcoming show. The KC Ice Center is located two miles west of 435 off of Johnson Drive, and our taping will start at around 1230 that day. On June 9th, we'll be at a new location, Old Shawnee Pizza, located about a half a mile north of Shawnee Mission Parkway on Neiman Road. On June 16th, we will be out at Mafia Pizzeria Southside, located at 127th and Metcalf, and our taping will start at about 12.30 that day. And then I'm guessing, and I need to talk to the guy that we're going to interview here in a second. Hopefully on June 23rd, we'll be back here at Danny Jackson's Incredible at 151st and Antioch. And our taping, we started today at about 1 o'clock. So our taping will start about 1. So come on out and join us. You might see yourself on TV. Now I want to mention one more thing that we'll be doing at Incredible, and it happens on July 10th. The date of the All-Star Game, uh, we're going to talk with Danny about that a little bit as well, but I'll give you some of the basics. Uh, KC Sports is co-hosting an All-Star Watch Party here. You'll be able to come on out and eat a great uh, baseball barbecue buffet. Watch the All-Star Game on many of the big screen TVs that are around. You'll be able to bowl. You'll be able to play laser tag or mini golf as well. We'll have some former major leaguers there, plus prizes that we'll be giving away and tickets for this event. Our $75 with proceeds benefiting the KC Baseball Historical Society, which is a not-for-profit organization that celebrates baseball history and brings together fans and players and historians to share memories and information on all aspects of baseball. Now, tickets can be purchased right now at Incredible by calling 913-851-1700. You can also register to win a couple of tickets to this event by emailing your name, your address, phone, and, of course, obviously your email address, which will come in with the email, to freestuff at kcsportspaper.com. So register today. We could see you at an incredible for the All-Star Game Watch Party. Now, I also want to mention one more thing. Uh, from June 1st through 3rd, you can enjoy downtown days in Lee Summit. Uh, They'll have a couple of bands there, like Killer Queen, which is a Queen tribute band, Landslide, a Fleetwood Mac tribute band, and food as well out there. And when you visit the Sports Zone at Downtown Days, you can see such things as as some KC celebs like Matt Brown of UMKC Men's Basketball, uh, KC Command players, Sean Pearson from KU, Anthony Davis uh, from the KC Chiefs, Missouri Comet players, and, of course, my friend Bob Rennison from the Missouri Mavericks. A whole lot more as well. And all you need to do is visit LeeSummitDowntownDays.com for more information on that. Okay, let's get to the important part of the show here. Uh, From the stuff that I was talking about, Greg, of course, was an important part of the show as well. We are joined, uh, and Greg has come back and is joining us as well, but we're also joined by former 85 Uh, Royal, two-time World Series champ and two-time Major League All-Star, Danny Jackson. He's also the owner of Incredible here. Welcome, Danny. Thank you, Steve. It's a pleasure being here. Uh, Yeah, (laughs) it's a pleasure being being (laughs) Being at home. (laughs) (laughs) In in my own place, yeah. So um, now I'm going to throw it to Greg first because Greg had a two-part question. Oh, Danny, it's great to be here with you. And uh, (coughs) Steve, real quick, uh, when we used to be in spring training together, uh, I used to have to face him. In batting practice, and, I wondered uh, if you guys had. Ever and done it was it, it got me in a slump facing him in, in spring <laughs> training. So I just want to tell you, Danny, thanks a lot. Anyway, <laughs> any way I can help you. <laughs> but uh, there's, hopefully, there's a lot of um, um, men or women watching us with children that are want to have their kids play baseball. And I'm going to give you two questions to address to these people. If if their son or their uh, 
is a good pitcher or good hitter. Uh, when do you tell them they, they should continue as a hitter or a pitcher in their career, number one? And number two, uh, can you give it, uh, you know, uh, and a piece of advice for anybody that, that is going to uh, bl- have, have their uh, kid be a pitcher in high school or even think about going to college? One, one advice uh, thing that you give them to, to proceed to be a pitcher when they get out of high school? Well, when we start with the younger kids about being a pitcher and, or a hitter, I've always said that they should continue on doing both of them. Now, if hitting-wise they're really not that, that good, if we're talking about a, a a kid that's probably you know only hitting 275 or or uh, maybe 300 or something like that in little league. Yeah, hey, that the, was the, good for me. Well, <laughs> it it was good for me too. <laughs> <laughs> but you may want to start them as pitching most of the time. I couldn't throw strikes that. though. Yeah, well, <laughs> then you better just play some defense. <laughs> but uh, that's that's probably when when you should probably start that and and i wouldn't start it they they make their decision most of the time when they're in uh high school when they start as a freshman the coaches make that decision for them pretty yeah. much so i say let them go all the way up to high school and and that decision would may be made then um for the high school kids going out and and wanting to be a a, a pitcher first thing i would say is don't ever throw a breaking ball even at a young kid don't throw a breaking ball until you Someone said something the other day that I thought was pretty good. Until you have facial hair, <laughs> because that means that you're pretty much grown and that you know you're you're able to handle the the, the stress on the arm. And uh, the other thing is just make sure you're running and working out and doing all the things. You know, it was always taboo. Oh, don't work out with upper body and all that. That's you know that's crazy. Work out your upper body. Work out your lower body. Stretch. And just work hard, and if you work hard, a lot of good things will happen. You just don't want to add muscle to the upper body in the, in the same way that maybe a football player would. It's, oh, a, it's a different. It's a different workout. Yeah, yeah, yeah you're yeah. doing you're doing reps of on the upper body of, you know, ten to twelve reps, and doing you know four sets or three sets. But then when you when you get stronger, as you do get stronger when you're doing that, you're going to increase your reps. You know to 15 and 16 and 17 well then if you're at 15 16 17 reps and on three or four sets then it's time to move it up five to ten pounds right right and then you build it back up and and then you keep on stretching now that's just strength and endurance what i call because it's kind of endurance and strength at the same time and that's what you want as a baseball player right right well let's let me ask you uh probably the question that you've probably been asked a whole bunch of times like in 85 you were 23 years old and put under some tremendous pressure and came through, obviously, in, the, in that tremendous pressure. The Royals were down three games to one in the American League Championship Series. And you came in and you pitched and you had a complete game and kind of turned things around there. And then in the World Series, it was the same situation. You're down to the Cardinals, three games to one. Game five comes up. They hand you the ball. And you got there with, I mean, I guess you got nothing to lose in a sense because, you know, it... it it, it gives you a chance to get out there, but what kind of pressure was that? I mean, 23 year old individual, that's, you know, that's a tremendous amount of pressure to have all those people shouting and screaming and cheering and yelling and, and being in the background in your head. Well, basically, both times that I was pitching in game five, I had a little chip on my shoulder that yeah. gave me a little incentive and more concentration. Um, the first was in the, in the playoffs and in the championship series where I was supposed to pitch game number four. Mm-hmm. And they moved me to throw Charlie Liebren again, and I was like, "You got to be kidding me!" Charlie <laughs> got nailed on the first game, and then they <laughs> they moved me back to the fifth game and, and put him in the fourth. And I'm like, "I was po'd, I was mad," right, yeah, you know. And I'm yeah. like, "How can you do that?" You know. And so, um, but it all worked out because Charlie threw a good game then too. And then you know, I came in and and I think we lost that game, but it was a close game. It wasn't like we got blown out or anything. Uh, so he, he did throw a good game, and, and then I went and I threw the game five with that chip on my shoulder, and, you know, and uh, never forget Jamie Quirk coming in and saying, hey, DJ, there is no pressure because you pitch bad, we lose, we go home. Right. And yeah. that's all. Yeah. Okay, so yeah. all right. Yeah. Uh, but, no, there's a lot of pressure. And then at, at that time, too, I just hit a groove. Uh, I was slumping in September, and then I uh, pitched against California and threw a good game, and then, the next game, I threw another good game, and then kept on getting better and better. So I, I, I started a streak at the right time and was pitching pretty well. And the other chip I had in the World Series was my wife and I were walking around in St. Louis, and they already had 
World Series champion, St. Louis Cardinals. <laughs> and I'm like, the game's not even played yet. <laughs> and they had these T-shirts going around. So that put a little incentive Little in did they know that the Cardinal fans were the reason. <laughs> well, I wouldn't say the Cardinal fans. I would say the vendors. The vendors. Ah, yeah, okay. See, the vendors had the T-shirts out already ah, and gotcha. said, hey, World Series champion. Gotcha. I'm like, ah. You guys are uh, <laughs> jumping the gun a little bit here, so that's what happened in that in that game, and How you know, funny. and we had some some great plays, and and it just everything worked out. And I think as a team as a whole, we never felt that both those teams were better than us. We felt like every game that we lost, we gave it away to Did them. You? We didn't yeah. actually, you know, we didn't actually lose it. We gave it away because we had opportunities to win, and we just didn't get it done. So. Sure. Sure. Yeah, you played on several different teams that all, that went to the World Series. Uh, was there some special chemistry with those teams compared to the years that you? I mean, you made you made like the first. You had first place, and you made in your career. You you were there about every other year or so. I mean, it was like eight times you went to the the championship series for your for your league or something like that. But was there some special chemistry with those teams that uh, you didn't see in other times in your career? Well, most of it was that. Uh, we had some good veteran players, mm -hmm. and we had a, a mix of good young players. And it was both defense and pitching that we had and all the teams that we won with. Really? And if you don't have that, you're not going to win. It's right. just flat out uh, because uh, it's always a saying in baseball that good pitching will eventually shut down your good hitting. Right. And it, can, it will happen. And, and all the, the teams that I played with, that we went to the championship and, and the playoffs, we had four starters that were good, and then we had some great relievers that were, you know, three, four, and five of the, of the relievers that your closer and then your setup guy and, you, and your middle relief mm -hmm. guy that were very, very good. Mm -hmm. And uh, and they were both left and right-handed. It wasn't one way or another, so we had a good mix. Right, right. Um, well, I want to... I got a zillion other questions, baseball questions for you, but we want to roll over to Incredible here. How long? How long have you owned Incredible? You actually built it from the ground up. Yeah, we built it from the ground up in 1997, and uh, we've owned it for 15 years, and and we we kind of evolved in what we are now, the Family Entertainment Center, where we put in a laser tag and a golf, and then the bowling, and then now we have a, a private room where people can come in and rent. You know the private area, which is bowling and and your own pool table and and uh, food and all that in there that we cater to you. And then we have the upstairs where we do a lot of banquets. We do uh, bar mitzvahs, bar mitzvahs, wedding receptions, uh, corporate outings up there. We do a lot of lock-ins and and in fact we got a big lock-in on Sunday. Uh, oh night. really? Yeah, Sunday night. And uh, so that we'll be up till. 3, 4 in the morning with that lock-in from a high school, and it, and it's always great to have those things. You know, they come in, and they do all the three things and have a great time, and we cater them to, you know, for pizza and some other things. So, um, And then we have the breakfast nook that we opened up. We serve breakfast from and lunch from uh, 7 a.m. all the way to 2 p.m. every day now, and, and that is starting to pick off because uh, what we've done is, is kind of, reevaluated our marketing and, and gone to the value pack or the the money mailer thing and it's a buy one get one free monday through thursday and then the weekends you know it's like a cup of coffee or something that mm -hmm. you may get and mm -hmm. so it's really built up the business and i think people have r realized that you know we have good service we have good food and it's quick and and they're starting to enjoy it a lot more. Right, breakfast uh, for breakfast or breakfast for lunch, whichever well, one. Whatever you want to yeah, do. Which is really nice, yeah, it's really nice. Um, so, uh, and it's a family business. Yes. You, it, not only is it catered to families, uh, you know, but it's also a family business. Your family works here as well. Right, we have uh, three out of my four kids that work here, so, you know, and then we got a Who's lot of... Who's the rebel? What's the... Well, <laughs> she's a... No, I'm she, just kidding. Yeah, I know, <laughs> but what she does, she she rides horses, and she's a ah. trainer for horses for the uh, yeah. hunter jumpers, and so it, that, that's a pretty tough job, and no she kidding. loves that, but, uh, yeah, we have uh, three out of the four here, and then they work in different areas uh, as far as the... Uh, uh, the bowling center is concerned, and, and uh, they've been great. And, and uh, But, you know, it comes with some hardship, too, because uh, every once in a while you have to lay the law down to them, too. <laughs> and uh, it's it's not easy because you separ you try to separate dad from employer. Right, you know? and that and is that, tough. That's tough. Uh, that is but, tough. 
you know, my wife's here all the time too with us, and and, and um, so it's 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 good family family entertainment for sure. Now, how many people do you usually have come through the doors in the course of a year? Have you ever done a count? I really haven't done a count, but I you know estimate about a hundred thousand to one hundred twenty thousand yeah. people that come here and visit uh, in a year, and uh, obviously the more we get them to repeat the better it is for everybody and and the employees love it too because uh it, the more people that come in we get them to get raises right <laughs> <laughs> Fam- family gets raises and and then the other employees as well now you offer solutions for schools and charity fundraisers and all those types of things as well there are many other programs that you have in place as well tell us about some of those yeah we have a lot of good different programs for schools you know so that they can raise money for their field trips or wherever they're going to and and uh some fundraisers they can call about but uh, the one that we got going that we're really proud of and we started it first here in kansas city is the the uh say no to drugs say yes to bowling and what that is is you come in and, and you purchase for ten dollars a, a coupon and that coupon has the day's from uh, June 1st all the way to September 31st, and it's a free game of bowling to the child uh, all all that mm-hmm. period of time. Mm-hmm. And it's it's basically just to, to get the kids off out of the street for an hour and let them come and bowl and enjoy themselves and all that. And, and then the, the object is, is, from when I first started it, is that uh, um, any time you get a child off the streets, it kind of eliminates them that hour from getting in trouble or right. doing something to get themselves in trouble. And right. that's why we started it uh, right. to, in the summertime because I know when I was a kid, uh, I was always looking for something to do, and, <laughs> and I got myself in trouble a little bit here and there. But fortunately, I wasn't real, real bad where I, you know, was arrested or anything like that. But, you know, you, you tend to get in trouble and do some things because mm-hmm. you know that. But uh, that's what this does. It, it keeps them off the streets for just an hour, and, yeah. and they come and have a good time. And that's called the Safe Paths membership, right? Yes. Yep. Now, you also have something coming up called Summerfest that starts on June 1st? Yeah, that starts June 1st, and, and that Summerfest is just a, 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 a daily special that we have every day from Monday through uh, Saturday or Sunday, and, um, you know, so any time of the day, there's something different for that special, gotcha. and it, um, it could be a double play, and you get a a free slushy, uh, or we have a Fiesta Thursdays, you know, where you can eat so many tacos and you bowl for so much and, and those type things. Uh, so it, it's uh, call up and find out which, what day it is, and then they can tell you, okay, it's this, this, and this, and, and, and you can look it up on the Internet, too, at incredible.com. Now, you also mentioned to me when I was here earlier in the week, you've got something special that's going on for Father's Day, uh, a triathlon. Yeah, we're doing a triathlon for Father's Day, and it's kind of bring the kids together, and it starts on uh, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday before Father's right. Day. And what they do, they come in here, and it's the, the father-son, and it'll be a bowling where the child will bowl first and the father will bowl the next uh, spot. And then they go over, and then they'll, they'll go over, and they'll do a doubles over there in the putt-putt, and then they go and do play laser tag. And when they do all those things they get a score and it, it'll say okay you guys are experts at this or <laughs> or you guys are good or you guys are average and you know you get a little certificate and and then uh, the father gets to go into the breakfast nook eat free with the kids as once the kids pay for the for the meal we know where the money's coming from but right <laughs> right of course yeah <laughs> but uh and, and they can go in there and the fathers eat free and and with a, a child that pays so it, it's it's a good thing for the fathers and the and the the kids to get together and, and have a little bit of fun with one another and, and kind of bonding. And a great memory thing, for yeah. especially for the kids and for the dads, I'm sure. Yeah. It's a great memory thing. So, And then, of course, we've only got about three minutes or so left, but we want to talk about the incredible All star game watch party that we're doing here. Um, fill us in on... Well, it is. It's $75 for a ticket, and you can sign up here at Incredible, and it's just to uh, watch the All-Star game because uh, uh, have a lot of fun. There will be 200 uh, tickets that will go out, and we'll have some former uh, players here to sign autographs, and, and then you'll serve a nice barbecue dinner along with that, and you get all the activities that you want to do, as much laser tag, much golf, and much bowling you want to do and then plus you're going to watch the game because we'll have the the game on all the the tvs and and then uh we're going to look at the 
getting some big screens up here too to put those up and so that they can see the game a little bit better and it's just a, a fun way to get the family out or, or friends out and, and have a good safe time here in Incredible by watching the All-Star game. Absolutely and you're located at 151st in Antioch. Phone is 913-851-1700. Incredible A in the middle of that. Incredible.com Facebook page? You have a Facebook yes page? we have a Facebook. And, uh, Does so it have the dashes in there? Is it in cred dash a dash bowl? Well, that's a question could, I don't it know. Could, could it could be, be that way. It could so. be, and so, so we'll, we'll find that out. <laughs> okay, yeah, well, <clears throat> I think it is. I think I saw it when I came in. But um, uh, we've got, how long do we have, Blake? Blake had uh, one quick question. Blake had a question regarding uh, Eric Hosmer, and uh, he wanted me to ask you that about slumps. When somebody goes into a slump, give me the quick answer to uh, what you think, Greg. Uh, slump is try to hit the ball the other way. Really? That's a quick one, yeah. And Danny? Yep. Hit the ball the other way, get on a tee, and hit line drives the other way uh, off a tee, and, and that's how you get rid of it. Really? Yeah. And just, just outwork, work harder than yeah. you work, or do you take, take any time off and just clear your head and, you know? Well, you can do that, but I don't, you know, the, the thing that he has to do is stop trying to, you know, I was watching him a couple of times, and his front shoulder flying open. That's mm. an easy out <clears throat> for mm-hmm. pitchers. If you see your front shoulder flying, then that's exactly what he's doing. He's not staying and hitting the ball the other way like it was last year. Last year he was doing awesome, hitting the ball the other way and hitting home runs the other way. Mm-hmm. He's not doing that this year, and that's the difference. Gotcha, gotcha. Well, believe it or not, that will do it for our show. Uh, I want to thank Incredible uh, for being our guest and Danny Jackson. I want to thank Greg Pryor for joining us today. Thank you so much from LifePriority.com. Of course, Danny, thank you for coming and talking with us as well. Be sure to join me, Steve Fish, again next week at the same time for Good Sports, Kansas City Sports and Fitness, and She KC Show. And check out some of our other shows on YouTube. Search for the Good Sports KC channel. So until next week, be sure to read all about sports, health, and exercise in KC Sports and Fitness and She KC magazines. You'll find them all over Kansas City, and they're free, so pick them up today. These days, we're all so busy, and many of us ignore our health and let stress turn into chronic pain. Dr. Lynn McIntosh of Kansas City Chiropractic understands the pressures we all face and the demands they place on our bodies. Dr. McIntosh can provide you with the proper care to relieve pain and stress, improve your health, and get more out of life. To make an appointment with Dr. McIntosh, call 816-753-4600. Most insurance plans are welcome. For more information on Dr. McIntosh and Kansas City Chiropractic, go online at kansascitychiropractic.com. The next time you're planning a group outing, choose yellow and choose first. Those yellow buses you see that transport your kids can also be rented for activities like taking a group to the big game, corporate events, church or youth group trips, special events, shuttles, and more. Choose yellow by contacting First Student Charter Bus Rental for safe, affordable, and reliable group transportation. With eight KC locations, there's a yellow office near you. For a list of locations, visit firstcharterbus.com. That's firstcharterbus.com. And choose yellow and choose first. There's a 27-hole golf course and a 10,000-square-foot athletic club in the heart of Overland Park. It's Brookridge Golf and Fitness. Come check out Brookridge Golf and Fitness at 103rd and Antioch today. Golf, fitness, group exercise, personal training, swimming, junior golf, and casual dining all in one place. Brookridge Golf and Fitness. For more information, call 913-648-1600 or visit brookridgegf.com. And mention this ad on Good Sports and get your first month free when you become a member. Sign up now for fun at Volleyball Beach. It's the perfect way to stay in shape and enjoy the outdoors. For over 22 years, Volleyball Beach has been KC's number one sand volleyball spot. With 13 courts, Volleyball Beach has leagues every Sunday through Friday evening. And sign up now for summer and fall leagues. For more information, visit Volleyball Beach at 13105 Home. Call 816-942-2820 or visit VolleyballBeach.com. Bring basketball fever to your own backyard or driveway with your very own game court from Sport Court of Kansas City. Let Sport Court come and install a basketball game court at your home. Game courts can also be installed for volleyball, racket sports, soccer, tennis, or roller hockey. So sink that basket at the buzzer and have your own Final Four at home in your backyard or driveway Sport Court. For more details, call Sport Court at 913-963-7529 or visit sportcourtkc.com. Here are two great specials you can take advantage of with your coupon in Kansas City Sports. 
Get a half-price green fee or save 75% on your new member initiation at Great Life Golf at River Oaks. Call 816-966-8111 for details. Hyperbaric Oxygen Therapy. It's an unusual name, but it's a simple, safe, effective, and affordable sports injury treatment solution. Hyperbaric Oxygen Therapy has been used by players from the NFL, MLB, PGA, and more to speed recovery from injuries. Now, Hyperbaric Oxygen Therapy is available at Summit of Health, 200 Northeast Chipman in Lee Summit. Go online at summitofhealth.com or call Dr. Susan Anschutz at 816-554-4771 to find out how Hyperbaric Oxygen Therapy can help speed your recovery from injuries. 